Hey, praise the Lord. Glory to God. He gets all the praise and all the glory. I just want to tell you this morning that, hey, God loves us. And he loved us when we were in darkness. He loved us. So no matter what you may be going through, no matter what you've done, no matter what 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 you're having struggles with, just continue to seek the Lord. Continue to pray, persevere through whatever you're going through. And I'm telling you, the the the, the something's going to work out for you. Great. God bless you. God is going to make things happen for you. You are blessed. You are wonderfully and fearfully made. You are a child of the Most High God, the one who sits on the throne. The heavens is His throne, and the earth is His footstool. Sometimes we got to remember who when He He the heavens is His throne. And the earth is his footstool. He already knows your future. He can see the time. He can see the past. And he said he is the Alpha and the Omega, the beginning and the end. So that means he's already, he's God. That means he's just God. He's so powerful, so mighty. God just is here. He wasn't made by nobody. He is just God. You know, there was God. Man, it's just a wonderful thing to know that God is God. And he knows all things and he's God. I mean, he's, he's, he's wonderful, you know, and he made a way for us to partake in that glory in heaven. And I just want to encourage people that this morning, man, we got a wonderful thing laying in store. We got a hope for us laying in store in heavenly places. This worldly stuff is, is, is irrelevant. We're, we're, we're here for a reason, for a purpose to, to serve the Lord so we can help other people into the eternal kingdom, not this perishable stuff here. This stuff, Paul said, I count all this stuff rubbish, garbage, basically. And, and that's here, you know, and, and because he, he, he said if it didn't, if it didn't bring him gain with Christ, then it was garbage to him. I'm not, you know, I'm just want to encourage people today to set your mind on heavenly things. Be thankful in all things that you may be going through. He will provide what you need. God is mighty. He's on the throne. <laughs> he runs things. He's in control. Jesus is the head of all principality and all authority. He carries the government on his back. Remember that. So God bless you. Have a blessed and wonderful day. If God before you, nothing can be against you. If you, if you're struggling with things, it's only to get you closer to God. Just just continue, continue praying and trusting the Lord. Let that continue to let that good, all these things work together for to create a genuine faith in Jesus Christ, so He can use you effectively. He's got a purpose and plan for you. Just let Him finish what He started. He's he, He's He's going to perform it to the day of Jesus Christ. He'll never stop working on us because we're just children. We only know in part. We're just little children, but He has mercy on us, and He had and He's given us grace, a gift of God that is free. We've been saved by grace through faith. Not of ourselves. It is a gift of God. And, 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 and to be his workmanship created in Christ Jesus to good works so we can do good things for him. And he's going to continue working on us. So don't get discouraged. Continue to move forward. God bless.